Ah, it's Mr. G. Now here's a simple recipe for feeding up your friends, family or flatmates. Here are the items and a list of the ingredients that you'll need. Start by placing the beef mince in a pan and cooking it through. This may take up to 20 minutes. So, while the mince is cooking, take the potatoes, peel them, and cut them into thin slices. Cook the potatoes until still firm. This may take 10 to 15 minutes. When the mince is browned, I put it in a sieve and run very hot water through it to remove as much fat as possible. The mince is returned to the pan and pasta sauce is added. Leave the mince then to simmer for at least 20 minutes. Some further water, sauces or herbs may be added to the mince at this time, as is your taste. For the sauce, add two tablespoons of butter or margarine and soften in the microwave. To make this dish gluten-free, use corn flour instead of flour, make sure the pasta sauce is gluten-free and of course the breadcrumbs on top gluten free. As an addition to the basic recipe, onion and bacon can be cooked with the butter. The flour is then added and mixed in along with the mustard, the, the cheese and three to four cups of milk. The cheese sauce is microwaved for around 5 minutes with occasional stirring. Continue till the sauce is thickened but do not boil. Now place half of the mince in the dish followed by half of the potato and half of the cheese sauce. Then add the remaining mince, potato and cheese sauce. Top it off with breadcrumbs and grated cheese. Bake it in the oven at around 200 degrees C for at least 20 minutes. And don't forget your veggies. Throw in a few green peas. This recipe does take a bit of time, but good things do, and Kiwis know that.